Good morning. While we wait for our garden to come into production, we've opted to get organic produce from Misfit Market. So our box just arrived for this week and I want to take you along as I open it up, see what we got, see how it's packed and see if it's something you might be interested in. So misfit items with the misfit market are items that maybe look a little weird so they aren't sellable produce. It might come from, all the produce actually comes from small farms, not the mega corporations. And maybe, uh, someone, or maybe someone ordered something that then they didn't take the order so it's available. Maybe a farm has an overabundance of something. All this stuff would end up just going to waste, which is a crying shame because it's good organic produce. They take all this stuff in from small farmers and they make it available for resale to the public through their mail order site. Now you go on, they just made some recent changes. You have the opportunity to go on the site, pick the size of box you want, pick the day that you want it delivered each week. I think you can even get multiple boxes if you want. And the new change is that you can pick from anything on their site, which they do have some grocery items as well. So those are included. You go through, you can pick from anything on their site, and now you can add multiples of an item. So you're not locked into things like say, one bunch of radishes, one bunch of turnips. Uh, we did on this order, order some sweet corn. I ordered a couple packs of two sweet corn and there was something else, which I can't remember off the top of my head at the moment, that I ordered that ended up not being available. So they just took those items, the price of those items off of the price of our box for this week. What's nice about this mail order service too, is that you can either skip deliveries. You can skip deliveries for up to six months if you like. We're getting good organic produce, which is nutrient dense food that is better for my body, better for all of our bodies, and it helps to heal my body. So it's something, like I said, while our garden's not in production, it's an option that we're doing. We may even continue it later. We'll see what the options are. You do tend to get seasonal selections because obviously that's what the farmers are growing. But it makes me feel good knowing that I'm keeping this food out of the waste stream. And I'm also supporting small farmers who often can't compete against the mega farm corporation. If you're interested, I have a code for Misfit Markets where you can get $15 off your first box. I do get a discount off of a future box of mine if you use that code as well. So it would be appreciated. Um, but you're under no obligation to do that. It's just something that I wanted to make available to you. In the future, I'll show you some videos where you can see how we use some of these vegetables. My thought too is there's enough of some of these items that if by chance we don't use them, we're still actually eating on our box from last week. If we don't use them, then we can um, go ahead and put them up and have them for later. If you find this video helpful, and would like to see more things like this, please like and subscribe and I'll catch you on the flip side.